Hello, um, I forgot what your name is. No matter. Um, this is one of the problems with using simple math. Simple math, um, by your taking out that we're only responsible for point such and such of the warming based on what's going up there, you're forgetting the natural flux of phenomena and the natural flux of temperatures, which have already happened for the better part of several, th um, you know, millions of years, thousands to millions of years. The problem with this is the fact that the natural levels of CO2 and the natural levels of cloud cover, etc., are there's natural systems which allow for um, temperatures that we can live at. That's why my other videos point out that when you jack more carbon dioxide and greenhouse gases in general up into the atmosphere, the more infrared radiation gets absorbed. You have to take into account kinetic theory of uh, kinetic molecular theory of gases, the universal gas laws, and I mean even mine is just a simple uh, is just a relatively simple analysis. I mean that's the reason why we have the. Um, complicated computer models is because there's a whole bunch more math that goes into this than what we are just working with here.